Today I'm showing y'all how to make the Jordan Terminal 23 Court two different versions, man. Make sure y'all like up. We're trying to get 30 likes. Make sure to subscribe. We're trying to get to 12k subscribers. So at first there was not many logos and stuff, so I had to really just like do it myself, which is tough. It took a lot of time, so make sure y'all like up. Outside perimeter is gonna be this color right here. So the outside perimeter, um, you just pick. You could pick like a blackish color and just move all the way above like the R type, like right here. Um, around right there, you know, you see the R like right there. This is only on PS4. If you're on PS5, it is a little bit more difficult. Just try to get it around where you see it fit. Uh, but there's no other way to like differentiate or like really specify where I'm at in the color uh, part. But yeah, it's, it's, it's around right here. There it goes. It's really easy. Inside perimeter is going to be above the L. So same thing. Just pick black or white and then move above the L on the color wheel. You know what I'm saying? And you could do the color wheel. The color wheel is very difficult, especially on PS5. It's like a different version. Just try to get it, as I said. Um, try to get it where it's, at, where it's at right here. Apron is going to be black. See, that, that part's easy for you. Uh, free throw circle outside key is going to be above the like square or above the... Um, if you're on Xbox, it's probably like a... It's like X. Um, it's like just move just to the left of the color wheel to the C of the color wheel. There I go. Free throw circle inside key is above the C and the O. Outside key is above the O and the L. Inside key is gonna be above the button. Yeah, just just try to see where you see fit, man. I, I know it's kind of difficult, but you could do it. I believe in you. <laughs> Out of bounds. Now this is the easy part, man. So you just go to a team. You know, oh, you probably you probably have these colors. For me, I already have these colors. But you can go to uh, let's say you don't have those colors, right? You can go to a team. You can go to the Pistons and pick this top right color. Just try to move it like around. Right here is fine. You know, above the C. Just keep doing that with the half court one. Do that. Do the same thing. The jump ball circle. Just pick red. Pick red. It's pretty easy. I mean, it could be lighter. I guess lighter is a uh, yeah. It should be lighter. Just a little bit lighter. Yeah, like right there. The center circle is is white. Deep online color, do the thing, same thing with the pistons, just make it blue. And same thing for all of these, they're all blue. A little bit more of a dark blue. The media box, I don't really like it. You could you could put it blue, but it's like it don't even make sense for real for right now. Baseline size is gonna be terminal. The font's gonna be alpha slab one and the font color is white, so that's pretty easy. Spell that out. Baseline size is gonna be jump man. Um that one is gonna be federal. Well, I don't even know how to say that, but you know what I'm saying? The font is that and the and the font color is white, so there I go. The sideline text is gonna be Jordan and the font is cream puff. Same thing with the mellow, the font is cream puff. They're both just lower caps except for the uh first letter. The center court logo, and this is where it gets a little bit more difficult for y'all because no one really has a fit one. Like you like there's this one, but it's so it's small. I mean, I, if you want you use a small one, but I made these bigger ones, pause. Um, so you could search up my name. So you could put in, how you search up is just you you go to custom image, press that, press on that, and then you press triangle or Y or wherever you are, search by online ID. And this is my old gamer tag. So it's gonna be O, V, O, Fields, G, C. So you search for this, this is how you search it. Just do this every time you're trying to search a logo that I made, just do this, you know what I'm saying? It's pretty easy. So once you do that, you see all the logos I made. So there's a white or a black one. Um, This is the, how the white one looks. This is how black one looks. So it's really up to you. Um, I kind of want to do the white one, but the black one just fits so much more with the um the other logos. So for now with the white, I don't know. It's, it's pretty difficult. You pick whatever you want for real. It's your court, not mine. <laughs> Secondary logo, custom image, same thing. You, you press on that button, search by online D. You just put O, V, O, Vios, and then G, C. You could put mellow. So you could put 23 if you want on the, on the bottom left, but 23 is already for the arena logo. So what I'm doing is I'm putting mellow for both. So like it just feels better anyway. So there you go, mellow here and mellow here. It's perfect. For the arena name custom logo, you put my name again. You just search up my name and you should find this number 23 right here. You put that and then arena name logo too. I made this one, you know what I'm saying? So you put terminal 23, there you go. So you're basically already done. Make sure that reading the name logo size is, and the logo size are 100. What you could do is put the center logo size down if you want. You know what I'm saying? It was that quick. So yeah. Um, Jumbotron, you could do what you want with that. Scores table. The scores table one. I'm putting custom images. Uh, you just try to find any custom image that fits with the core or whatever custom image you want. The only image I have, if you search up my name, is this one. This is my uh, this is like my banner for YouTube. What I did was I just searched a little bit, and on this fourth page, you see Jordan, which makes sense, of course. Um, and I use PS5, but it's really what you want, you know. It's really what you want. The seating, um, I try to do it like a like a grayish color, but I don't know. It, it wasn't. I mean, that kind of hit for real. That kind of hit, I guess, but 
I, you could do black or, or uh, black or gray, not orange. Black or gray. I said I said orange. The basket is gonna be blue. Uh, that's how it is in real life. It's blue. So it's a little bit of darker blue like that. Uh, maybe try to match it with the line colors like that. That's fine. But there you go. The court is already done. You're just boom. It's done like that. And I know, I know it's a little annoying because you see the red, uh, the red, the red center circle. But it took it has it to where you can't even take that off. So if you really want, you can try to put it blue or make it as dark as you can so that it, like it kind of kind of disappears or if you have like a um like a logo that's white or black maybe try to put it with like the black so it matches or white um or you could even try to put it as like a, um as a lighter color so that way it can fit with the court maybe like this yeah it don't even let you do that so i guess i just make it black for real so yeah there you go already done we got another another court i'm gonna show y'all how to do it it's it's, it's a little bit more com uh, colorful this is the real life court but i'm gonna show y'all another little tutorial on how to do this next court so let's get right into it it's kind of look clean if the line colors are white it kind of look clean so you could do that or maybe even black let me see how black look you know what i'm saying hey you could do that it's really your court i'm not gonna lie i kind of like this one this is how the next court looks um it's a little bit you know it's more blue and just light you know, it's not it's not the real court. I don't think I just made it up for real. First, you gotta make the line colors white, just because they're not gonna let you change the colors from the other court I did. So you gotta make the line colors white. What you do for the outside perimeter is you just put you just pick the blue that's in the Lakers. This one right here, the light blue, the baby blue, and you just actually I think it's you just leave it. You don't have to move it. The inside perimeter is the same thing, except you gotta move it a little bit. So it's one, two, three, four, five. No, no, it's three. It's three. Not nah, four, it's four. Four to the left. Uh, free throw circle outside key is the same thing. Four to the left. You just pick the Lakers color. So you just pick one, two, three, four to the left. Um, the inside key is gonna be even lighter. So it's probably like six to the left. The free throw circle inside key is the same as the outside perimeter. You know, it's like that light blue, so you don't even have to move it. Outside key is gonna be same thing. The free throw circle inside key, you pick the Lakers color again. And you just move it one to the left. The Lakers color again with the Outside is one to the left. The inside key is the same as the free throw circle outside key and the inside perimeter. So it's going to be one, two, three, four, four to the left, right? Yeah, four to the left. That's pretty much it, man. That's how you do the court. Uh, I kind of like the other one better, but this one is clean. Like, it's like a um, something about it is just like very clean and slick. I don't know how to describe it, but uh, you can make the basket a lot of color too if you want, or you can make it like white. Uh, it kind of matches. The white kind of matches, or let me try the Lakers color. And yeah, there y'all go, man. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. We got another one coming out soon. Yeah, we got that coming soon, you know what I'm saying? But I hope you enjoyed. Like, subscribe, and deuces. Have a good day. Enjoy again.